Hi guys, it's Musical this year, uh, and welcome to another GG update. I got some news on some upcoming content, um, some music, some dual mixes, stuff, uh, uh, yeah, all that kind of jazz, but, um, first things first, I gotta get the rest of the stuff out of the way, so, top priority right now, see if he's... For those who have been patient for the tutorials and Silence Call, I appreciate it. Um, I have had to redo my footage because it didn't look so good. But I should have that out by tomorrow afternoon at the latest. Um, as for Silence Call, uh, we should have that out in the next 30 days or so. Um, we've had some scrambles behind the scenes. But uh, yeah, everything should be, we should have it out in the next 30 days. Again, thank you guys for being very, very patient. Uh, it's been a long wait, I know, so I hope you guys can bear with us and wait a little bit longer. Uh, in terms of other gaming content, I should have the rest of the Splatfest up. Um, I'm going to warn you right now, though. Uh, <laughs> these next two parts, parts, and they are final, my final ones. One of them's good, but the other one... Let's just say, say, a, it's, the it's the Splatoon equivalent of our Rocket League live stream. Yeah, that bad. <sighs> oh well. Oh, uh, at, least it wa at least it wasn't live. <laughs> but still. Um, anyways, ways, and I also have one more Marvel versus, um, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3, like, uh, uh, video with co-op from Ethan, and that one's a lot better, just saying. So, yeah. Um, you probably have noticed a couple brand changes across my and Ethan and Laura's Twitters, so I'll go over that real quick. Laura has a totally new logo, uh, it has a suitcase. Just to uh, symbolize that she's the head honcho, the big boss of the Go Gamers. Uh, so, yeah, that is her new logo. I will be using that from this point forward. Uh, uh, unless she wants to change, like always again. So, yeah. But that will be a new logo from this point forward. I, I do plan to add some a couple things so it's a little bit more unique. But, yeah. Um... Um, in addition to me and Ethan, uh, you probably have noticed that my ba our banners have changed to reflect some new changes in our likes, likes and upcoming games. So for mine, mine, you may have noticed that I have um, added some um, uh, uh, brand new banner. Uh, portfolio pick is the same. I decided to keep our portfolio picks the same for the most part because, well. The next big thing for me is Sonic isn't for probably a couple of years. Um, and the Sonic movie is not coming out till next year, so I really don't feel like changing right now. Uh, that being said, though, oh, uh, uh, the banner, as you probably have seen, has three things on it. My The show I'm currently show slash anime I'm currently watching, an upcoming game, and an upcoming show slash cartoon I will be watching. Uh, it, uh, so for the show, it's Scooby-Doo and Guess Who, which goes back to the classic style Scooby-Doo that we're all used to better than the look of Be Cool Scooby-Doo. I heard that the actual content is good, but I, I just can't wa watch it with that. No, sorry, that look just yeah. Uh, but uh, I did hear the content's good, so that's good. But again, <laughs> can't watch it because of the design. It it would just bug me too much. I'm sorry. Uh, but Scooby Doo and Guess Who is in the vein for those who don't know of um Sco the new Scooby Doo movies. You guys probably all remember that from the old days. Is where Scooby would team up with real-life celebrities and often fiction uh, cartoon heroes like Josie and the Pussycats, Batman and Robin, who they teamed up with twice, and must I add, Ad have teamed up quite a couple other times, too, outside of that. So, 
they've met up quite often. Um, and a couple others, too. So this is in the vein of that. Um, I haven't seen any of the new episodes yet because I just haven't had time. But when I do get a chance to sit down and watch it, watch it, I will probably let you guys know what I think. Uh, I did see a little bit of the first new first episode, though. It looks very good. Glad to be back to the good old Scooby-Doo, I have a number. Instead of the... Uh, garbage. Garbage be cool Scooby-Doo look. Thank you, Warner Brothers. Uh, it doesn't forgive you for Teen Titans Go, just oh, so you know, by the way. Um... And then, obviously, upcoming game with Five Free House is coming out this week. I changed my banner to reflect that. Um, and then, finally, finally, uh, upcoming TV show, which obviously you guys can probably tell tell by the lo look of the banner and the glyphs I've been posting on my Twitter lately, Blue Scoos and You. <laughs> so, yeah, three things. As for Ethan... Uh, as for Farm of Free Houses and specifics for both me and Ethan, I did our banners to reflect what houses we'll be really starting the game with when we first get our copies of the game. So, for Ethan, that would be the Blue Lions, and for me, that's the Black Eagles. So, uh, I did, I put the banners for each, uh, to reflect that. Ethan has a whole banner with a portfolio pick of the leader of uh, the Blue Lions, Lions with the banner on the side, as well as all of his other stuff um, on there. But for me, me, uh, I just put a banner and the logo below, so I would have enough food for both, but yeah. So, uh, yeah, uh, I will be doing uh, uh, that. That will be the current style for me at the moment. Moment for those who don't know, I in honor of the upcoming Blue Screws, we Blue Blue Screws and You. Uh, I will be changing my style once again to reflect Blue Screws and You's um, reveal trailer background, where you see Josh and Blue for the first time, as well as near the end of that trailer. So, yeah, that's what it's me to reflect in case you were wondering. Um, but yeah, so that is what my. Uh, uh, that is uh, all in terms of branding stuff. Now in terms of music stuff, which I'm pretty sure a lot of you are wondering. Okay, so I got some good news and bad news. Good news! Uh, I will have more information about upcoming dual mix albums next month. Uh, I don't know when next month, but I do have uh, pictures ready for an MC Direct talking about updates for big stuff, so, um, yeah, I should have more information about that very, very soon. Uh, in terms of delays, I have decided to delay all but three albums, uh, until further notice. Orders for next year or even beyond that. So, for, um, so that would be anything I've previously announced in previous directs, except for three. Gambler Clues, unless we, me and, uh, Game Gambler, by the way, Game Gambler, Gotta talk on DM if you've watched this. Um, uh, 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 music Clues Duo Mix Madness. And finally, uh, obviously, Music Clues The New Year's, which is a collaboration of 2017, 2018, and 2019's, aka this year's, uh, Best Duo Mixes. So, yeah. There's a little update on that, at too. So, um, yeah, more on that later. Um, and if you guys are wondering why I haven't been posting too many dual mixes, that's because most of them are for dual mixing madness. So I won't be posting too many of those. Those I will post a couple, but not uh, again, not too many of them because I don't want to take away from all my other ones. Uh, but yeah. Uh, so definitely look forward to, uh, Dual Mix and Madness. Like I said, it's my largest album to date. So, yeah. All right. Um, that is all for now. So I get, oh, and one more thing. Um, in terms of upcoming coverage for gaming, gaming, um, obviously we will have upcoming coverage for all new Sea Thieves content hopefully soon. <laughs> Uh, once Will gets back, that is, we will probably try to pull out a couple more videos in addition to Siren's Call and all that. Um, and we will also have, um, I'm trying to think. 
Sorry, drawing a blank. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, we will have five of free houses coverage. It will only be for my end this time, so you will only see um, uh, 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 Black Eagles. But when I do beat the game for the first time around, I will try to cover the other two houses so you guys can see what those, those are like from that perspective. And, um, yeah. Oh, and in terms of unboxing, speaking of which, uh, Ethan is going to try to, uh, our plan is if Ethan can't come over this next weekend, um, he's going to do an unboxing from his end showing off the special edition, but, uh, uh, if not, then, um, uh, if, so, if he is coming over, then he and I will, you know, do our usual skin stuff, <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I'm looking forward to uh, playing uh, playing three houses myself. So, yeah. Um, in terms of upcoming coverage for any conventions, nothing really big big coming up. Uh, nothing from Gamescom. Uh, I will say those for those who are going to Gamescom and Gamecon and uh, uh, coming from the U.S. and traveling over there. Uh, SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated will be there to play for the very first time, so be sure to look forward to that. Can't wait to see what gameplay looks like. Like, it's been a very long time since I played that game, and like I said, I'm buying it on all platforms. Well, except for PC, of course. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So, um, uh, but yeah. Uh,. Uh, and obviously, all Nintendo exclusives in the future, Pokemon Sword and Shield included in that, will be coming up. And I will have a special countdown to talk about closer to Sword and Shield's launch. Uh, but, can't talk about it now, but much, much closer. Uh, I will have more information about that in a future Go Gamer Direct, uh, when I'm able to cover more on stuff coming to the channel. But, for the time being... Being, uh, this is all I have to really share right now. I hope you guys can be a little bit more patient for content. Thank you for sticking around. And if you're new to the Go Gamers, please subscribe to us. Um, I'm, my name is Music Clues. I'm returning to the Go Gamers this fall with some more content. Uh, so I look forward to seeing you guys very soon. Um, but yeah. I'll see you guys later. MC out.